Hello boys and girls, Premier League action, or well, I hope there's Premier League action because the weather is absolutely atrocious. Where I am, it is snowing really, really badly. Um, I've already struggled to get off my drive and I've actually smacked my car into one of the posts as it comes off the drive. Ah, oh, great start to the morning. I'm hearing it's raining in Southampton though. But it's about getting there first. If we do and the game goes ahead, it's a massive game. We've got to get three points. Come and join me and find out how I get on today. So to give you a little update of what's actually going on, I don't know if I'm even going to get to the game, to be honest. Um, I've just spoken to Robbie and um, he's actually stuck in Milton Keynes and um, it looks like he's definitely not getting there. There's two and a half hours till kickoff. The roads are absolutely atrocious. We've had to come off one other way because of the M25 going towards the M40 is just absolutely ridiculous and I don't know what we're doing right now. I really don't. It's bad really really bad so the motorway you can't even see the road there's nothing people are just driving through snow it's i haven't seen it like this in a long long time um so yeah i'll keep you updated the match day vlog may well be me sat in the car listening to the game on the radio that'll be a first so um here's an update for you I'm currently walking on the M25. We ain't moving anywhere. I actually think this is it. I'm gonna miss the game um, because we're at a standstill and it's just, there's a couple of cars moving, but just behind me, nah, it's completely and utterly gridlocked. Lorries are jackknifing. Everyone's just all over the gaff. And as you can see, it's snowing really bad still. So yeah, looks like that's it. I'm gonna have to try and listen to it on the radio. Um, or maybe get home and watch it on the telly. So the game's about to start, and I'm in my car. <laughs> and I'm listening to it on the fucking radio. Seven matches they play, and that will just give Southampton that little bit of hope. One nil down already within the first five minutes. Yay! Amazing! They're a goal down after two minutes and ten seconds. Kim, they just caught cold. The ball goes into Call the cold. From the flick Amazing, that, isn't it? Tadic picks it up. First Who would have thought you got cold Tadic when it's cold? Still, still sat in the car. Still listening to the game the on the radio. Third. And it's still 1-0 to Southampton. Southampton. To take it quickly. Great. Southampton. I'm hoping to get home by half time. And I can pull it on the telly. Great. Well, there's a surprise. A goalkeeper that's saving everything. Where did that happen last time? It's Fraser Forster, man. Always seems to play a blinder against us. So we're losing at half time. 1 0. Um, we didn't do too bad by all accounts after we went 1 0 down. But again, crap, slow start. Puts us in the mess. Second half's just about to get underway. And um, yeah, if we don't change things up, then we're going to lose again. And I'm back at home now. Great crack. Oh so God. it's over an hour gone. And um, lots of possession, but no cutting edge. Where have we heard that one before? Oh, Mertesack has come off for Welbeck. I think he's gone to a 4 3 3. We have been awful. Not the first time I've said that, is it? Be honest, Southampton should be 2 0 up. Bertrand, which is an absolute shambles. <laughs> God, there's one silver lining so far. It's not actually having to be there and witness this crap. Yes! Yes! I don't fucking believe it! I've gone to the fucking shop because I thought these bastards won't score and it's just flashed up on my phone. Olivier Giroud! Equalised! Na 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 na! I don't even know how long the game's left. Oh my god, what is going on? Oh, we played crap and we might have salvaged it. Yes! Whoa! Feel like doing a knee slide in the snow. Ha ha ha! Come on! 
so the game's finished 1-1 one, one. Oh, I didn't get to see a lot of the game um, heard quite a bit on radio from what I can gather it was a poor start again defensively just like the Manchester United game we were lucky it was only 1-0 and um, and then we managed to claw it back and salvage a point. But it's not good enough. It's another poor performance away from home in the league. And the same old frailties keep coming back to haunt us every single time. So I don't know. I really don't. His, I heard Mertesacker was poor and at fault for the goal. I heard that Alexis was awful. Um, but he will get away with it because he um, assisted the goal. But that doesn't make up for the rest of the time that he played. So, I don't know. They let me down again. I'm going indoors. I'm freezing. So, there's a silver lining. I didn't miss that. There we go.